What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We got a new episode of Pop the Balloon. The lineup of guys were nice, so let's get into it. Um, so I'm hella chill. So is I, I work 30. Come in. What's your name? Um, I'm Vanessa. Vanessa, how old are you? I'm 30. 30, and what do you do? I actually have two jobs. Um, so my corporate job, I work for a debt settlement company. Okay. So we help people get out of, um, get out of debt, debt, credit card debt, sorry. <laughs> and then um, my I got little brunch. side hustle is I am a server at a brunch restaurant okay. in South Phoenix, Brunch House. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> now, what are some things you like to do for fun? Um, so I'm hella chill. So okay. um, I have two kids, two boys. Uh-uh. Damn. I actually have two jobs. Um, so my corporate job, what I happened? work for a debt settlement company. Okay, so cannot we... wait to pop that. What happened? Um, <laughs> um, my oldest is gonna be twelve in August okay. uh, or in November. I'm sorry, and then my baby is eight. Okay. Um, but what I like to do for fun, I just I like to go to restaurants, mm -hmm. try new um, restaurants and cocktails. Okay. Um, I like to sports bet. I go to the casino. Mm, I like well, to gamble fun. a little bit. I like blackjack. Oh, uh, damn. <laughs> a little bit, not a lot, <laughs> a little bit. Um, I used to work for a casino, so that it started a long time ago. Okay. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty chill. Um, I, Hell, I don't really do too much. she make her own money? Why he tripping about her gambling a little bit, a little one of the two? I don't be out too much. Got it. Um, so yeah, and I work a lot. I work seven days a week. Wow. Damn. Um, I nah. have some free time though. I have a lot of free time, but uh -uh. I do work seven I'll days a week. So okay. I'm a little hustler. <laughs> so what are some things you look for in a man? She ain't so got I've time been single for, for almost three years. Work seven days a week and got babies. I, and I mean babies because she got to take care of them too. Girl, she ain't got time. Yeah. Um, so I kind of am new to Talking the about dating like free scene time. and what no, I'm you really, don't. really looking for. That's a lot. Um, I feel like. Um, and then I forgot to say, my voice is gone. Oh, oh. So I, I had a little game night last night, and we were playing and drinking, and I woke up, and my voice was gone this gone. morning. So Nigga, I do apologize. Pop it. Why are you just um, looking at the cameraman to see if you should pop it? I don't like him. I don't like Lapolo Polo, uh, Polo Loafer. And I hate your socks. But, like, he keep looking at everybody to see if he should pop it or not. <laughs> I'm mean, just doing you. You're, you're good. You're good. Because <laughs> um, he over there like. Oh, uh, what was the question? Oh, uh, what are some things you look for in a man? <laughs> Pop it, nigga. Uh, I feel Pop like. <laughs> I feel like I'm um, saying. What did she say? Um. Oh, uh, what was the question? Oh, uh, what are some things you look for in a man? <laughs> uh, I feel like. <laughs> I feel like I'm um, saying someone that's respectful. Mm -hmm. Um. Someone that's caring. I feel like all those things are really cliche. Him holding up that balloon with that toothpick, baby. I just, he would have pissed me off. <laughs> I would have had to go holler at him first. You know, but what's up? What's the problem? Um, what I'm looking for in a man is someone that is super funny. I'm hella goofy, so I like to joke and I like to um, crack jokes. Like I'm, I'm always laughing. I'm always a good time. Um, I'm looking for someone who's close to their family. Um, I was raised in a two-parent household. I'm really, really close to my family. So, um, someone who's very family-oriented. Mm -hmm. Um, someone who can have a dope intellectual conversation with me. Okay. That is super huge to me. Communication, it kind of ties into that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. Now, what are some of your deal breakers? Um, so one is going to be someone who doesn't know how to effectively communicate right, with feel, me. Mm. But um, it doesn't have to be when she is getting asked a lot of questions, though. And we have a problem or an issue. Um, just communicating with me on all aspects. Um, someone who has like bad relationships uh, with close friends. Four, four, four in the chat. Um, and then, yeah, okay. a couple. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we did get um, a few pop balloons. Let's go on over okay, there, see why start. they ended up popping. Let's nice start right thing. over here. Mm -hmm. We can have your name and age. Ramon, 36. And Ramon, what do you do? Ramon. Uh, I own an auto detailing company. I do Airbnb and own a fleet of cars as well. Okay. So why did it end up popping your balloon? It just seemed like uh, she wasn't really paying attention to your questions a little bit, you okay. know, and uh, maybe it might have been because she was nervous, yeah. but, you know, you asked a couple questions multiple times and it kind of 
you know, communication. It's just nerves, that's all. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. All right, yeah. For so. sure. No, no hard feelings. Now, is Ramon someone that's your type? Um, I like your swag. I love the J, I love the watch. Yeah, I mean, I've never dated a bald guy before. Okay. So, but it's not, I, yeah. <laughs> I haven't, but yeah, I like your swag. I mean, yeah, yeah. You seem cool. I like your teeth too. So, for sure. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Let's go on down here. Yes, we can start with your name and age. Uh, Braylon, I'm 37. And Braylon, what do you do? I work in mental health. I counsel people with substance abuse and mental health issues. And uh, why did you end up popping your balloon? The first thing I saw was the tat on the neck, and that's crazy work at our age. Okay. So um, I wasn't rocking with it. Okay. It's the mental health, but fucking with a woman's mental health. That's crazy work because she got a little tattoo. Bitch, please. That just pissed me off. Okay. Um, she was fidgety with the answers. Um, Y'all popped it on the two kids because two was too many. Okay. One um, baby daddy, though. One baby daddy. One baby daddy. One baby daddy. Mm, very good co-parenting relationship as well, so. That is yeah. awesome. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So the tat on the neck. I got it. it. For me. <laughs> that's cool. All right. So is he someone that's your type? Oh uh, yeah, he's cool too. I, uh, the Vans I haven't seen a like a grown man wear Vans in a while. I oh. love the fit though. Like I, I like it's cool. That. Like some Miami shit. So yeah, yeah, yeah you cute. All right. Thank you. <laughs> we got one over here. Why is the tat on Let's the start neck? Start with your name and age. My name is Kashim. It's not that big. And thirty-eight. Okay. And what do you do? Um, supply chain management. What is that? And why did you end up popping your balloon? I was trying to give you a chance. I was trying. I was like, all right. Like, you know, yeah, I understand the nerves and everything, yeah. right? I mm -hmm. get that. But when you said, um, I don't really date bald men, and I'm short <laughs> on top of that. I didn't say that. I said like, I haven't dated a bald man And then you got on before. heels, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, I, yeah. I felt like if I would have kept that balloon, you'd have been like, because you're too short. So it was a preemptive pop, but no, nah, you're, you're well put together. Thank you. Um, yeah, I understand the nerves part. Yeah. But when you said the thing about well, <laughs> Yeah, and that's my answer. No, respect <laughs> it, respect, respect. So, no, you, I mean, you didn't say you don't date bald guys. You just said you haven't before. No, I don't think I said that. I said I haven't dated a bald man okay. before. Okay. Yeah, Not that it's ex out or anything. <laughs> I don't want to be an experiment. I, you know. <laughs> so is he someone that is your type? Um, not typically. Uh -huh. I, yeah, yeah, I no. I mean, I, yeah, no. <laughs> Why not? Um, he's, he is he's short. short. Uh, yeah. yeah, you just, like, I can date a lot of the dudes that I do talk to, like, they have to be, like, either my height or mm -hmm. taller. Okay. So you're not, not, you don't a necessarily have to be A lot of the dudes tall, that I do talk mm -hmm. to, you heard of Mr. Scary Balloon? Yeah. Yeah. I see what I saw that. <laughs> he's so scared Thank to pop you. that balloon. It's going over here. Let's start with your name and age. Anthony, I'm uh, 36. Anthony, what do you do? I'm a barber. Okay. And uh, why did you I end up popping tell. your balloon? Uh, she gambles and I gamble, and I felt like that wouldn't be that a good be. mix. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Everything else was good, but when she say she gamble, she cute. Uh, she a nice you. specimen. I be done blew the bag. Dang! <laughs> I'd rather not. Okay. That's a real nigga. That was Anthony. Someone that's your type. Oh uh, yeah, I like the tattoos, um, the watch. I I, I I immediately look at the swag, like mm. what you got on. But you're real cute. I like your swag. You cool. Appreciate it. Yeah, okay. I would. Right. Any time. Head on back. <laughs> <laughs> we did get a pup back here. Let's start with your name and age. Antoine, I'm 35. Antoine, what do you do? I'm a school safety specialist. I do private protection on the side. I'm also a real estate investor and a restaurant investor. Okay. Like and uh, why did lot. you end up popping your balloon? It was just the kids. Like, you look amazing. Thank you. It was just the kids for me. Um, and then gambling. I don't gamble. I live in a city where it's gambling. I'm from Jersey okay. in Atlantic City. So, like, that's all it was. You look great, though. Thank you. I appreciate yeah. it. Thank you. All right. And now, is um, Antoine someone that's your type? Um, yeah. Okay. Yeah, you cute. I like your swag. She I like lying. your outfit. Appreciate you. Yeah, you have a cute. She's so. lying. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so we do still have two unpopped balloons. Okay. Um, she like I'm like, she lying. I'm gonna go ahead and have you ask these remaining guys a question just to kind of help you narrow it down, see who's more of your match. Okay. I ain't gonna lie, the crop top button up is crazy, but his body was nice. The nigga got, he got some arms and, and look like a little bit of chest on him. He nice looking, he's a nice looking guy. What y'all talk about? Okay, go ahead with your question. <laughs> um, so, 
So I have like a serious question, then I have an icebreaker question. Okay. But um, my first question would be, are you close to your family? Okay. Ooh, let's start over here. Let's start with your name and age. Uh, JD, I'm 35. JD, what do you do? I'm a building engineer. I fix everything except for the relationships. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> then to answer her question, are you close with your family? Oh yeah, I'm a mama's boy, so for oh, sure. Yeah. My dad, he wasn't really around when I, you know, when I was growing up, due to like other things, you know, like I can't really talk about. But yeah, yeah. Sure. But I had a stepdad though that raised me, you know, since did I was two. Any, so did you have any sisters or anything like? Oh uh, yeah, I got sisters and brothers. Okay, yeah. that's one thing I like is like a man that's brought up around like women. Mm. They have, they seem to have like a like understanding of women and stuff, so yeah. cool. Yeah. Okay. Let's go to our next guy. I, I agree with that. Your name and age? Hey, Brian K. Johnson, 37, about to be 38. Okay. And Brian, what do you do? I work for the county. I work for the water department. You look like And it. just to answer her question, um, are you close with your family? Speaking of my water bill, sir, let me tell you them. I'm sick of it. And not even water. I ain't even mad at y'all yet because I ain't got the bill. But them lights. Woo! Really? Yes, I'm very close with the family that's remaining. Uh, Mama's boy, like he said, uh, my dad was around, but they divorced. Stepdad was there. I'm big on, I'm from the South, so I'm big on Southern hospitality and family, Christian, go to church on Sunday type of deal. For sure. Okay, and I think you said you had an icebreaker question as well? Um, yes. Okay. My icebreaker question is, okay, well, who's I your ain't favorite artist? Bad. Mine, uh, what is it, 270? <clears throat> Y'all know this is our first little house situation, girl, so I'm new to this highlight bill. Two fifty nine. Yeah. Me, I'm a Welcome. songwriter. Okay. I'm a songwriter. So I mean, not to be I'm a Leo too, so I gotta pick me first. Oh, but uh, outside of that, uh, I'd like everybody for what they're doing. Everybody brings something to the table, but you know, my favorite Beanie Siegel, outside of that, you know, being from Atlanta. It's Mac. It's Mac, yeah, Philly. Yo, Philly and Atlanta. Well, I'm doing but, uh, a good job. Outside of job. that, I love Atlanta artists. I just like everybody just going out for what they like and doing it, you know, actually having a plan to execute. So, <laughs> yeah. for sure. For sure. For sure. Let's go back. Who's your favorite artist? They probably in the house. Uh, favorite artist, man. That's easy. You know, I'm from LA, so Nipsey Hustle, man. Okay. Long live Nip. Okay, yeah. You know, yeah. long live the great. <laughs> yeah. All right. Now, guys, any questions for her? Uh, not off top. Like, I got to. You got to think about it? You got a question <laughs> ready? <laughs> Hold on one second. What's your zodiac sign? I'm a Capricorn. Capricorn. Yeah, I'm a okay. Capricorn, January 14th. Okay, and you from okay, this man. area? I'm from, born and raised in South Phoenix, yes. South Phoenix, mm -hmm. okay. And you're yeah. willing to go to Atlanta? or? Um, Probably not, <laughs> only because... My just, kids. It's yeah. okay. Would you? Everybody moves to Atlanta. They love it. <laughs> not trying Probably to get them not. to Atlanta. I, mean, I, got, I got some years left before my baby turns sure. 18. So. Sure. <laughs> Damn. Probably be like good pen pal. Some years left. She sound like us. <laughs> Remember she said. Sorry. Remember she said she got the good co-parenting going on. So I ain't gonna lie. When you got a a, a co-parenting situation. Not even one that's just so good, but that's decent. You know, you ain't moving. I ain't gonna lie. You ain't moving. We got some years to be. But uh, at this point, we don't want to go nowhere. It's just ugly. Everywhere. I would love to go to Houston and get a nice house full of low ski. But hell, I don't want to be there for three months and then find out my whole house about to get tore down. We ain't got no motherfucking power. The whole, everything flooded. I don't have time for that. But outside of that, that's the only place. <laughs> so, yeah, absolutely. Okay. okay. So you're gonna you're gonna pop with that. I'm, I'm still gonna hang tight, but okay. I'm, I'm still here. All right, all right. <laughs> um, Just to feed off of that, I'm a Capricorn too, January 6th. Okay. So that's, that's what's up. Team, birthday. Yeah, Team Capricorn. Um, how's your relationship like with your uh, your baby daddy? Um, so as I stated, we have a super good co-parenting relationship. Um, I was with him for nine years, but. We started dating when I was 16. He was 17. So um, we just were too young. You know, we went through a lot of things together, didn't know how to deal with them. Um, so we just parted ways. Our kids are happy. Um, like, I couldn't ask for a better relationship with him at this point. So, Dang. yeah, it's good. It's great, it's great. Yeah. All right, girl. Well, I'm going to go ahead and hand said, you asked. a pick. I don't think Time I would have said. So. Okay. I'm going to ask for a better relationship with him i would have said co-parenting relationship you got to be careful 
Especially with niggas, but you really got to be careful. There you go. All right. Just go ahead and pop one of them. I'm going to just say I will be open to either of y'all, but I got to pop yours only because of my kids in and Atlanta. I'm scared to pop yours. <laughs> yeah, but you can add me on Insta or something. Oh, you know. Oh, damn. <laughs> it's Kaede, most definitely. Michelle, nice Remind to meet me you, Raven. though. Well, I know name Raven from Atlanta, so. Okay. <laughs> okay, let me bring you on up. Come on up here with us. Come on up, come on up. He want to pop. You guys screw up here. Come on. <laughs> All right. Any final questions? Uh, no, nah, I think, honestly, uh, I mean, you're gorgeous. You're beautiful. He about the pop. But I think the kids is like a deal breaker for me, like, because okay. I ain't got no kids, so. Okay. I'm not trying to start my own family and all that, but you're gorgeous, so. Thank like, you. For Thank you Thanks. Okay. Yeah. So you're popping? Yeah, I'm about to pop, yeah. Right. <laughs> I have you go back. I was <laughs> just about to say, I think he kind of fly, but I knew he didn't want his something. He was reserved. It is. They be hard on the mountains. Uh, that's, oh why, that's why I ain't having no more, because... Yeah. That very reason right there. But okay. yeah. All right. Well, girl, that is all the balloons popped, unfortunately. But we do thank you for coming on. Let's go ahead and give it up for her, guys. I'll take this mic. Nice to meet y'all. Y'all about to get one. Take your hand, girl. She said, kids, All right, guys. Let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. Hello, woo, woo, woo. welcome in. What's your name? Jamie. My name is Jamie. Jamie, how old are you? I'm 27. And what do you do? I am a business analyst. Okay. I will pop nice. because what of are some things I like to do for fun? I like to cook. <sighs> I like to beautiful, beautiful chocolate melanated woman. Not that I'm against light skinned women, green women, purple women, or any other color of a woman. I love all women. I am taken by a woman, but I'm just saying, y'all ain't gonna come for me. Um. I hate her fucking wig. That wig is pissing me off. Honey sauce, you seen, I, I always got you. Okay. Um, ooh, that wig. All right. Nice looking lady. Okay. To you, right? I like to read. I like to work out. I like to hang out with my family and my friends. Right. I just like to have fun. <laughs> and now, what are some things you look for in a man? Um, okay, so has to have a relationship with Jesus mm. first and foremost. Oh, uh, <laughs> okay. Look like a pack of noodles. <laughs> um, okay, oh, he has to God. be. Um, has a vision for his life, oh like um, business or something along the sorts of like, you know, <laughs> career figured out. Yeah. Oh my God. Um, family oriented. Um, I really look for character. <laughs> so like you're kind, you're patient, you're loving, those types of things. Um, oh shit. Yeah. Okay. Now what are some deal breakers? Deal breakers. No relationship with Jesus, first okay. and foremost. Oh, um, smoking. Mm. I don't do smoking. Um, emotional unavailability. Mm. Um, that's a deal breaker. Poor communication okay. that's a deal breaker. Um, yeah, that's it. All right. So we did get um, a few pop balloons. Let's go on over there and see why they ended up popping. Let's do it. I mean, she want a nigga to be perfect. We ain't okay, got if that. we can start with your name and age. Ramon, and I'm 36. I hate when you Ramon, say And Ramon, why did you end up popping your balloon? I'm a weed smoker. Okay. That's that's that, yeah. that's so what? is she someone that is your type? Yeah, she's beautiful. Thank you. I'm a weed smoker. Now is Ramon smoker. your type? Um, I would say no. Okay. Um, it's just the physical attraction piece. Okay. Yeah. Dang. Is there something specific? Um, can't think of anything specific. It's okay. just like at first glance, it's not like the physical attraction isn't there for me. Okay. All right. Cool. But I'm sure you're a great guy, though. Hey, likewise. <laughs> Let's go to our next guy. Your name and age? Uh, JD, 35. And JD, why did you end up popping your balloon? I smoke. Uh, I mean, she mentioned the smoking. You know, I'll be smoking Mary J, you know every once in a while so feel me okay I feel okay. that was probably a deal breaker for it so yeah yeah okay so apart from that is she someone that is yeah. your type though yeah i mean you about to get on my nerves every time i pick up a blunt girl okay uh, i rock with her <laughs> she was out. all right now is he someone that's your type um i would say no um why not just a physical attraction again the same thing like initially i just don't feel it but um Sure, you're a great guy. 
Respect, respect. It's yeah. all love. It's all love. Yeah. yeah, you know. yeah. yeah. <laughs> all right, let's go to our next guy here. Your name and age? Uh, Braylon. I'm 37. Okay. And Braylon, where did you pop your balloon? Um, initially, I saw, I thought that she was beautiful, but it was too much weave. Um, I know it. I don't like this dude. And he's a mental health dude. He ain't lying, though. That shit look like... <laughs> that shit look like a pack of Maracha. <laughs> okay. Top ramen. <laughs> <clears throat> but he's still rude, okay? He's so rude. The toes hanging off the shoes for me. God, um, did you say? So. Nigga said toes hanging off the shoes and shit. He's so rude. They are though. <laughs> yeah. It don't always be both of them, but that damn one of them. Yeah, I just kind of hey, the toe is like this. she gripping the side of the shoe. Oh. So it's not even trying to be, not even trying to be funny. It's just that's that's what I saw. <laughs> My toes. <laughs> oh. All right. Yeah, yeah. And then, like, I, oh my I smoke, God. I, I, I blow a little trees and everything like okay. that every now and then, so I don't need her judging me. You a mental health dude? You smoking a tree? Guys, they got. And then she talking about, like, Jesus thing, like, is is you bad because you not a Christian or wow. it's too much stress, man? I ain't, you know what I mean? Okay. Wow. But I'm sure you're a wonderful lady, though. Gonna top it off with that. Yeah. <laughs> that's nigga, that's Jesus. <laughs> no, is so he someone that's your type? I think I think you're attractive. I like your outfit. You. I like things being put together. I think you're attractive. I don't judge people who smoke, by the way. And you're not just if you don't have a relationship with God. That doesn't mean that you're a bad person. That's just what I look for. It wouldn't work out because. Right. He's like I take it very seriously in my life, and so if you if that's not something that you do, we would just it wouldn't you know we couldn't do things in harmony. But I'm that balloon highlighter. Yeah, that. but you really came for my toes. No. <laughs> I knew he would. <laughs> it's okay though. It's all love. I knew it's he love. would. It's, okay. it's all love. All right, thank you. Let's go to our next. Y'all ain't nothing wrong with the Lord. Me and him got our own relationship. Shout out to Jesus. But I'm not over here like honey sauce. If you don't like the Lord, let me tell you something. We ain't gonna work. I think it's funny as hell that only my head is in the camera. But we ain't gonna talk about it. Honey sauce, if me and you gonna work, Jesus got to be involved. Okay? And I just feel like that's a lot. <laughs> that's a lot on one person. Okay? So, but y'all, people be going through stuff like seeing death. There's a lot going on that... You know, something happened. This guy here, your name and age? My name is Kashim. I'm 38 years old. Okay. And Kashim, why did you end up popping your balloon? <clears throat> the Jesus thing. That's all it was. Um, okay. I believe in God. I have a relationship with God. But I'm not there yet with Jesus. Like, I'm still trying to figure that out. That's okay. So, um, in my experience, when I've talked to women that were very heavy into their religion, um, that was always a he point of friction <clears throat> and um, not even to a uh, level where they were willing to meet me halfway and actually teach me something. It was just like, oh, you don't believe in Jesus. At I'm like, all right, then. So um, that was that. So, yeah, that's my answer. OK, yeah. I understand. Is he someone that is your type? No, I would say no. Okay. Um, height. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, just super personal, Typical, a little bit yeah. taller. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you're very nice, though. You're very ah, kind. All right. I like yeah. your energy. All right. All right. <laughs> Thank you. Let's go over here. Um, <laughs> first and foremost, what religion are you? I'm Christian. W which form of Christian? I'm non denominational. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, my mom is Jehovah Witness, and my, my other half is born, they, they part Muslim in it. Okay. Uh, when she said that, I can't get jiggy with the okay. dog. Yeah. Got it. Other than that, I respect we, it. Okay, I don't nobody yeah. want to get into it. It's all good. Okay. <laughs> Is he someone that's your type? I would say no. Okay. 
What makes him not your type? Um, <laughs> you know, I like it's just the attraction piece. Like, I think it's just like don't there's roast a... him like he did your toes over there. Look at him. Wait, he want to say some more. He want to say something else. I don't like this man. Certain type of look that I typically go for, okay. um, like tall, dark, and like just certain like facial features. I guess I could say, but you don't fit those. I mean, he's tall. Yes, he yeah, that one. Yeah, you're fat. Right. Tall, you dark, you're just Ibbler or something. Shit. Like, no, I'm just fine. You good? I ain't tripping. <laughs> okay. I never understand why they be like, I'm so holy. I need a Jesus man, and come into a damn pop the balloon. You should be at the church, okay? Looking for you a man in the pulpit. Uh, like, for real. I don't understand. I don't understand at all. Okay. I'm good. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> and then we did right. get one up in the front. Behind the thousand eight label eight. Name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon? I'm Antoine. I'm 35. And I popped my balloon just because of the, I'm Muslim. You look okay. amazing, though. Thank and you. Man, don't let nobody stop you from Thank you. You know, doing what you do. You look great. As soon Thank as I saw you, you I was I immediately it. attracted to you. He's a nice it was just guy. That. That's all. Muslim. Okay. I respect it. For sure. <laughs> I respect it. Now, is he someone that's your type? I would say, yeah. Yeah. Okay. You're tall. You're handsome. Appreciate um, you. Yeah. You have like an alert we to you. We hate that shirt. I like it. But other Appreciate than yeah. that. You. Yeah. Hey. Great. All right, so we do have one balloon That's left nice on okay. Let's walk on over there. Mr. Leo, <laughs> she don't want you. All right, let's start with your name and age. Brian K. Johnson, 37. Okay, and Brian, you do still have your balloon unpopped. Why so? Very stunning. I don't like using beautiful. Everybody uses beautiful. <laughs> stunning. I like Thank that. You. Nah, that. Thank you. That was the Leo's move right, right now. <laughs> I know they are here to say something, but I like the white tone. I like the white tone. <laughs> and I love the Christian side. You know, I'm from the South, so we love going to church on Sunday, Chick-fil-A clothes on Sunday. I respect that. So, okay. For sure. For sure. He's not not a nomination type. Too. Yeah. For sure. So nice. I like that. You got a good like little seam look little vibe. What's the zodiac sign? Um I think I'm a Sag. I, Sag. Yeah. December, yeah. Right? November 29th. Yeah. Mm -hmm. you a Fire sign. I'm a Leo, so Leo okay. season for sure. Yeah. Okay. Y'all would for have sure. some like good that. sex. You got like a good well, since y'all so Christian, like somebody gotta get married. That Leo Sagittarius sex is pretty all right, but <clears throat> y'all will never know. <laughs> They'll never know. Like, uh, like maybe a flight attendant. No disrespect, but like you got like a cool They'll teacher flight attendant vibe. <laughs> what does that mean? Just kind of like helpful. <laughs> I kind of I'm rocking with that. I don't know if I'm misreading it, but oh, okay, helpful. I like that I'll helpful that. vibe. I appreciate a woman it. should be a helpmate. You know, yeah, so, man, I agree. So I respect that. Uh, I agree. Flaw, you what's in the wrong south? You? Or you in Phoenix? Or? I live in Maryland. Mm -hmm. Why? Yes. What you think about Atlanta? Atlanta. I have family in Atlanta. So yeah. yeah, him trying to get them to move to Atlanta is crazy. Yeah. Visit some time, okay. <laughs> okay, okay. I yeah, like I go that. there pretty frequently. Okay. I don't want to ask yeah. any oh, questions okay. before dinner. <laughs> <laughs> any questions for him? Anything? Um, okay, so tell me about your relationship. He with got look just really what like, um, like my every day trying to walk and get it right. Like have him like guide me, you know, in every step of me move I make. So okay. Sunday, I, I usually watch three or four uh, sermons on on TV if I don't actually go to church. You know, what I'm saying okay. if I do go to church. I go to my, my church, my bad, on the south side, you know, so I go to church, uh, Pastor Dollar's church. I don't know if you like mega churches, or are you a fan of that or you don't I like mean, that. I'm indifferent. I, I'm just trying to get the word. For sure. You know, <laughs> it's got to be somebody that's cooking the right, you know yeah. what I'm saying, meal. So, yeah, yeah. Pastor yeah. Dollar for sure is my pastor. Okay. Some people in Atlanta, it's like you like them and you don't, so. Oh, God, and the rest of these niggas in the lineup be at brunch on Sunday, drinking a mimosa with me and honey sauce. God is great. I feel like you have to have your own relationship first, and then everything else will follow. Oh, girl, that's all I'm gonna say. All right. Okay, I'm not familiar with him, but yeah. All right, I'm, I'm feeling a vibe here. I'm feeling a vibe. <laughs> Am I your type? Because I see different types that you don't like and do like. I don't want to waste your time if you I'm know not your type. Us. You know, for you me, it's the height thing. Height. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. it's important for I me because I, I like mean, I can to do wear like heels. this. I can wear, some... <laughs> <laughs> I can wear my like, my, what's it called? No, my, the, the, my heels. My, yeah, no, no heels. I'm, yeah, I'm from Atlanta, but we not them. But yeah, <laughs> but no heels, no heels. But uh, yeah, you know, Robert, Robert Downey Jr., I've been on set. He wears the shoes that make his feet look. Yeah, he does actually. Yeah, okay. they have those for men. So it's, but, yeah, um, it's yeah, a, I'm going to pop in because of oh. the height. Yeah. 
Yeah. You pop. I'm going to let you pop it. She doesn't have one. Oh, okay. I don't have one, yeah. Sorry. I don't know how to. I'm going to let you. I'm going to be a gentleman and let you pop it. Okay. Outside of the height, man, I rock with you, though. Like thank, you. Like thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I don't know his name. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Not so much weave. Missed an insult. <laughs> All right, well, that is all the balloons popped, but we do thank you so much for coming again. No, Let's go no, ahead and give it up for you guys. Thank you guys. Hold on, let me say something before y'all leave. We hate your hair. I definitely hate your hair. Beautiful person, though. Beautiful person. <laughs> Okay, let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. Woo! Single lady! Yeah! Woo -hoo -hoo. Hello, welcome in. What's your name? Hi, my name is Mercy. Um, Mercy. I'm 30 years old. Okay. I'm from Kisumu, Kenya, and I am a registered pharmacist. Okay. And yeah. All right, what are some things like to do for fun? Me. Um, I like cooking a little bit here and there. Okay. What you um, saying? I like modeling. Too, girl, that outfit is fire. What? No, that outfit is a ma y'all hating. That outfit is everything. <laughs> it's the damn um accent for me. No disrespect to nobody's accent. I'm just talking about what I can literally just deal with and watch right now. But no, her outfit. I like it. I like it. Bling. Um, I like fashion. Okay. Um, and what else? I love watching movies. All right. Yeah. What's your favorite movie? Man, it's so many. <laughs> Damn. There's <laughs> so many movies. I don't even know which one off the top of my head okay, right now. No problem. Yeah. Now, what are some things you look for in a man? Um, She's all of 105 pounds. Uh, that, that's for sure. For me, I would say uh, I want someone who's a man of God. You know, someone oh, who has a heart for golly. Jesus. Um, I want someone who is. Pop you know it. who knows what they want mm -hmm. i want someone who's emotionally available okay. um character is really big for me so someone who's humble someone who's kind mm -hmm. someone who's who has like a giving heart okay yeah. now what are some deal breakers Ooh, uh, kids okay someone Dang. who has kids um someone who smokes mm -hmm. i don't do smoking mm -hmm. um and i think those are like my top two okay yeah ladies as i shake my lavender that I'm late taking honey sauce. Jesus Christ, I ain't gonna be asleep to 4 a.m. Let me tell y'all something. Lavender help you sleep. Don't don't fuck that melatonin. It make me have bad dreams. If you having bad dreams, get you some lavender. Um girl. What? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Let me tell you something, lady. God, I just put it on my tongue. I don't know why I did it just now. But let me tell you something. Y'all got to be a little more open around here. You got to be a man of Jesus and got to be by the blood. And, uh, uh, wait. Exhausting. I, I just don't understand. All right, so we did get a few pop balloons. Okay. Let's go on over there and see why they ended up popping. Okay. All right, let's start with your name and age and why you wait, ended up what? Nick, why you do shorty in the orange like that? Look at her face. What you mean? Popping every balloon. I'm Antoine. I'm 35. And I pop my... You look amazing. Thank you. Listen, I pop my balloon because I'm Muslim. Okay. Um, and that's really it for real. Okay. No uh, problem. Okay. Now, is he someone that's your type? Yeah, he is. He's handsome. Um, He's really tall. And I like your outfit. Appreciate you. You're welcome. Appreciate it. <laughs> All right, let's go to our next guy here. Okay. Your name and age? Ramon, I'm, I'm and I'm 36. Ramon. Mm -hmm. And Ramon, why did you end up popping your balloon? Two reasons. I got two daughters. Okay. And I'm a weed smoker. Okay, no problem. <laughs> yeah, I like your swag, though. Thank you. Fly Appreciate there. it. For sure. <laughs> now, is he someone that's your type? <laughs> um, I'm Ramon. Not usually, uh, but I really like the outfit. You look really nice. Like, your swag is on point. I really like it. Appreciate okay. it. You're welcome. So what makes him not your usual type? Um, I usually go for someone taller, a okay. bit taller. You know, I feel like I'm a tall girl. I'm not too tall, but like, you know, you just a little bit. So I like, over there. you know, someone who's up here for me. Okay. Yeah, that's really it. Well, like how tall? Like, cause I'm six three. So I mean, <laughs> oh, I'm, a, I'm above average. Um, yeah. He's six three. The nigga gotta be six seven. I wouldn't even, you, but she right, he's right. He's like the same height as cuz over there. 
Way above average. I mean, I don't really want to say like six five. Usually, I would like six five, okay. but you know that's. Okay. She you be know, a different but type of dude. That's just then. my preference. But six foot and above is good. All the niggas I know, five ten and up. <laughs> five ten and up. That's it. Well, uh, Day is probably five eight, five nine. But yeah. Definitely five ten and up. But yeah. it's just you kind of look a little bit, you know, not as tall. I would say. Okay. I'm sorry. For sure. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's go to our next Flaw. guy. Yeah. Your name and age. Uh, JD, thirty five. Mm -hmm. And JD, why did you pop your balloon? Uh, I mean, honestly, uh, the shit go crazy. I ain't gonna lie to you. That shit, that shit fly. Thank you. Um, she just like too skinny. Like I like them a little thick. I be getting cold <laughs> at night, so I need something like to hold on to, to keep me warm. <laughs> Okay. That's all. Got it. Yeah. <laughs> that is JD, someone that's your type. Y'all think he got a Accenture bottle or um one of them little Aquafina, them little um the little bottles. Matter of fact, y'all think he got a Accenture bottle or a, a Benadryl? What do we think? Yeah, see y'all y'all courting shit more, so I don't be knowing. Okay, mid shrimp. Okay. A little one. So when they want a thick woman, y'all ever had a nigga like, I don't know if y'all thick or not, child, but I'm just saying if you are, you ever had a nigga that requested for you to be thick and then he came up short? Like y'all was probably talking on the phone like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? I like them thick. You know what I'm saying? And then y'all get with each other and then it's like, Yeah? Oh, my God. What you want all that ass for? Can't even, can't even fit, you know? <laughs> like, mm. Thumbs make me sad. I, I was about to say I feel you, friend, but whatever you feel, I understand. All right. Ooh, girl. Um, JD, no, not really. He's not someone that's my type. That's but good. you seem like you cool people though. Appreciate it. You're welcome. Yeah, what, what makes him not really your type? Um, he's just not my type. I mean, the height thing is number one. Um, I mean, the fit is cool. Um, the tattoos are really cool too. But I don't know. He's just okay. I can't really put my finger on it. But okay. it's like when you know, you kind of know. You feel me? Okay. But respect, respect. No that's problem. Love. Thank you. Yeah. Let's go over here. Your name Girl, and hey, age. Uh, Braylon, I'm 37. Okay. Braylon. What did you end up popping your balloon? Um. Cause I like to smile. Thank you. It's the hair, Cute. man. It's too much weave. It's okay. a lot going on. She said she was from Kenya, and I get a lot of scam calls. And I just <gasps> want to be dealing with that. And it's the, the accent. I feel like I'm going to be saying hi, what you say. Okay. Okay. But other than that, like, mm -hmm. like they say, I do like your fit and everything. Thank you. Yeah, it's, it's different. I never... It's cool. Thank yeah. you. So, beautiful All right. smile, by the way. Thank you. <laughs> and now, is he someone that's your type? Um, not really. Mm, but it's okay, though. Too short. No! How tall are you? Okay, you guys. No, 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 no. You look okay. like he's six <laughs> feet too. You're out here saying 6'5". I know. Okay, I'm saying 6'5", only because, like, you know, I have a lot of, like, tall guy friends. So, usually for me, I'm used to, like, really tall guys. So, you comparing us to your guy friends? Okay. That's crazy work. Okay, that's not what I'm saying. That's not what I'm saying. Pipe down, you know. <laughs> I'm saying I'm usually used to a lot of taller guys, and you're just not tall for me, and that's okay. Like no problem. Appreciate you know? that. No problem. Cool. Right. Let's go Thanks. down the girl. Cause next. <laughs> okay, let's start with your name and age. Fix my face. Oh, go ahead. <laughs> go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> Maybe he's trying my to go viral. My name's Kashim. I'm 38 years old. Mm -hmm. Oh, he just like Kashim, that. What did you end up popping your balloon? I got mad reasons, but I'm gonna hit you with three. No One, problem. the God thing, right? Mm -hmm. I hear that a lot. Let's just say I don't have a lot of good experience with women who say that they're looking for a man of God. Okay, no problem. Um, two, I got a son. Mm -hmm. You said you want a man with no kids. Okay. Um, three, not really my type, but you're cute, though. Like, okay. you know I mean? You well put together or whatever, but Thank you. I like him curvy. I like him with a little, you know what I mean? Okay. Word, so. No problem. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Y'all think he been a drill or a central bottle? Just so y'all know the difference. <laughs> <laughs> you know, y'all be out here in these dating streets or whatever, and your husband probably the same height. <clears throat> so, is it is it essential bottle or more like Benadryl? 
Let me know down in the chat. Middle. Maybe a little in between. Honey, I'll say essential. Okay. Christina said essential. I got your friend. <laughs> in between. All right. So he probably got a, he probably, he probably get the job done. Got you. Got you. Got you. Okay. So is uh, like Kashif someone that's your type? No, he's not my type. And it's not just because he's not tall. I know that's like a thing going on. Like, you know, we're not tall, da da da. But sometimes it's like when you know, you know. Okay. You know, so when you look, it's like he seems like he's cool, but he's just not my type. And not just because of the height thing, though. But yeah, thank okay. you. <laughs> like, okay. Even he doesn't believe you. I don't believe I'm that. so serious. Yo, yo, real, real quick, like, I'm if you take the heels, you'll be the same height, right? Okay. So at the end of the day, I get it. You're and then the nigga just keep the balloon. Unpop, knowing he too short. I mean, I just want you to know that I'm a man of God and I go to church every Sunday. I don't know if you're in the mega churches or whatever, but you know what I'm saying? I understand that I'm short, but I'm still going to try it anyway and I'm going to be a gentleman and let you pop the balloon yourself. <sighs> Preference and all, I'm mm -hmm. not even arguing with you. I'm just saying, like, mm -hmm. at the end of the day, we're mm -hmm. the same height. Okay. And then you just say these gentlemen over here that's taller than me mm -hmm. like, you want ain't tall enough for you. So, <clears throat> I'm good, though. I'm good. <laughs> Thank you. That's good for you. What's your name? Robert T. Washington. That's it. <laughs> Let's start with your name and age. My name is Anthony. I'm 37. <laughs> okay, Anthony, why did you pop your balloon? Six Hill Mary's. God forgive me, I'm not religious. Okay, that's okay. okay. Um, okay. Here and I don't know. I you just, good? <laughs> I didn't have nothing else after that. Like once you say that, I just kind of tune Long out. Skin it's okay. Like, this one good, definitely it's got okay. a big meat. <laughs> no, is that someone that's your type? No, he's not. Okay. He look like he got a big meat for no reason. He is that old faithful nigga you call at 3 a.m. Cause you know he just got out the club. What you doing? Hello. And then you make sure he leave for your kids get up for school in the morning. Am I am I ringing a bell? Am I ringing a bell, ladies? <laughs> um, I don't know. The fit is literally. <laughs> I mean, it's okay, but it's not really what I would prefer for a guy to wear. Like if it's a first date Can't type of stuff, dress. you know, I prefer a little <laughs> bit more dress. Fucking sideburns, stupid. <laughs> But he can eat some Gucci and got a big meat. And that's just it. So, Definitely. But that's it. All right. Thank you. <laughs> All right. We do what have an unpopped balloon uh, race. Raylan. What y'all think Raylan pulling up with? These are the examples. <laughs> Not just because he an asshole. PC ass ninja. What y'all think Raylan pulling up with? That's all white if y'all don't know. Mr. Asshole. A tiny one. He probably got a grow. He gives Ben. Y'all, what's Ben? What's Ben? What's that? Y'all have confused me with this Ben. Tiny with a hook. <laughs> yep, a grower. <laughs> Shrimp. Oh, Madison Benadryl. Is Ben Benadryl? Girl, who missed it was me. Went straight over my head. All right, Benadryl. Got it. Okay. Here. Okay. Let's start off with your name and age. Good old right. Benadryl with a curve. What y'all think about him? I think it's Essentia. I think both of them got an Essentia bottle. But he, if he's six three. He got to be about 6'4", six, 6'5". Six, oh, he the one. <laughs> Big. <laughs> Bald Ascension. <laughs> Bald? <laughs> Y'all think he shaved. He clean down there and shit. <laughs> I ain't going to lie. He got that energy when he when he be talking, so. Yeah, I believe it. Okay, Johnson, 37 out of Atlanta. Okay, so Brian, we see you still have your balloon popped. Type. Why so? Okay. Not tall, but uh, Man, sir. most definitely I like what I'm seeing. You know, my dad's so from Africa, so I respect the whole motherland movement and all that. I respect mm -hmm. that. What part really? of Africa? He's from, not the scam artist, but he's Nigerian. <laughs> he's Nigerian, but he's not, we're not from that village, yeah. 
But uh, yeah, I respect the accent. I respect all that. You know, I respect the southern. You know, I'm from the south, but we do respect the Atlanta to the Africa movement that's going on. He we just blew it. it. He's not on the scammer side. What? So I'm I'm rocking with the chocolate skin too. Okay. Skin thank, tone. Thank you. All right. Thank you. So, as we heard the whole six five thing, we know. <laughs> but is he someone that's your type? Um, I would say no. Okay. It's not okay. someone that's my type. And what is what is the type of size six um, five? I feel he, she already told you. I feel like just the the dressing is nice. Cool. Um, just the the physical attraction. Gotcha. I feel like there's not really any physical attraction there for me. Or muscles, right? Um, not just muscles, but I feel like when you know, like you know, you kind of know. You know when you know. Gotcha. Yeah, basically. Okay, no, so the physical That's attraction is just not there for me. Respectfully. Yeah. Gotcha. Just go, go ahead, pop. Okay. Just oh, just do it. Just it. do it. He's a fucking July Leo. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right, so like that's either. all the balloons popped, but yeah. we do thank you so much for coming thank on. You. Let's go ahead and give it up for her, guys. Yes, thank you. <laughs> right. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. Hello, welcome in. What's your name? Hi, everyone. I'm Alicia. Alicia, how old are you? I'm 28. And what do you do? So I am a student and as well a cocktail waitress and a content creator. Okay. And now what are some things you like to do for fun? I like to go to the gym. Ow! I like to Damn. You cook. I like to hang out with my friends, go shopping, go to the spa. Okay. Like girly things. <laughs> and now what are some things you look for in a man? Oh my I he don't like hate shopping. you. Uh, <laughs> that was very loud. Yikes. Okay, that's okay. <laughs> Some things that I like, or what'd you say, that I like in a man? Yeah. What is so I'm interested in people that are kind, okay. funny, um, I think <sighs> generous, romantic, and I think intellectual as well. Okay. Now, what are some deal breakers? I would say some- Girl, that's why he's single. Is giving gay. Deal breakers for me would be lack of self-control. Like, if you're kind of angry or grumpy, I'm not really, that's not my favorite thing. Mm. Lack of- <laughs> lack of effective communication okay. and then as well I would say lack of discipline because I do like the gym and things like that got it okay all right so we did get a couple of pop balloons let's okay. go on over there see why they ended up popping okay, okay your name and age uh Braylon 37 Cleveland Braylon. Ohio. Braylon why did you end up popping your balloon um, you asked about her occupation she mm -hmm. was like cocktail waitress and content creator and she said she liked to shop, but you know, the math ain't mathing because I'm not real jobs in a sense. So I feel like green shirt ready to like strong arm that nigga. Because what are you talking about? Nigga, where did your outfit come from? He looks like beauty supply store. Especially with that hat and them bitch ass vans you got on. You ain't got no money either with your fake Gucci watch. You got a fake Gucci band on an Apple watch. Fake ass Cartier's you probably got from Shein. I got the same ones. They was $2. I don't like this motherfucker right here. Those not even real jobs. You know, it seemed like you like to spend more than what you bring in, you know. But other than that, you're a very beautiful young lady. Ooh, you kind of deep in my pockets, but that is okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, watching don't talk to me too hard, but it's okay. It's okay. It works out, trust me. Okay. Bills pay. Sure. Period. Awesome. <laughs> now, is he someone that's your type? Um, yeah, you're handsome. I think you're well-dressed, handsome. Right. Yeah. Okay. All right. Thank you. Let's go down over here. Girl, I love when a woman is not bothered by a bitch-ass nigga. Hello. She did her thing on that one. Your name and age? Name is Kashim. And I'm 38 years old. And why did you end up popping your balloon? So, um, when, uh, <laughs> uh, give me a second. I'm trying to gather my thoughts here. Okay. Um, Damn. 
it was a couple of things, right? Content creator. What does that mean, right? I know we didn't get that far. Okay, it is what it is. Um, what? But outside of that, yeah, I just wasn't feeling it. I was y'all like, niggas are stupid as fuck. This woman right here platform y'all on is a content creator. You. I can't do it from the front because my titties hang low. She got more money than all y'all. Guarantee. Guarantee. She got more money than all y'all. I got more money than y'all. Fucking. Ugh. What they don't understand. Content creator, what is that, right? Uh, the platform you on right now? Can I see myself really matching with this young lady? Nah. Like, you, you're attractive. Don't get me wrong. Like, from head to toe, literally from head to toe, you're attractive. I just can't see it, though. So, that's just me. Yeah. Oh, oh, no, you know what? I just remember, my fault. You said you don't like people that's angry, right? Yes. I'm from New York. So, my normal disposition, people be like, oh, you're always angry. You ain't. No, I'm regular. <laughs> feel me? But, okay. You know what I mean? So, that's, that He's was aggressive. the thing that caught me. So, I was like, okay. damn, that's all right. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah so. All right. Now, is he someone that's your type? Not totally. I do think you're handsome. I, I do sometimes gravitate towards bald guys, which is kind of funny. But I do like a guy that's a little bit taller. I know everybody okay. makes fun of me because I'm a little short, but I do <laughs> like that as well. Okay. All right. Cool. All right. Cool. Yeah. Let's go to our next guy like here. Next. Name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. My name is Anthony and um, I'm 37, I think. 36. Bitch. Well, listen, the, like, the problem is Question my mark. birthday is at the last day of the year, so it like be throwing me off. Okay. But here nor there. You cold. Okay. So what happened was He's when you Capricorn. said the content creator, content creator, my bad. Make sure y'all edit that. Content creator. What I thought was you look like something that I like might go, you know, out back and take myself up top to. So I didn't know. What does that mean? You look like a porn star or something like that. Ooh, like, body like a porn star. I wouldn't yeah, say I, that though. It's lifestyle and beauty and like reviews. Yeah. It's more so wholesome. You know? I didn't know if it was real or not. So I was just like, oh, I'd rather not. I'm cool. No worries. That's okay. fine. All right. Next. No, is he someone that's your type? Up top. Go ahead. I don't know what that means. But no, not necessarily. I like a man that's a little bit more clean cut. But I do like the tattoos though. The jewelry's nice too. Appreciate you. Yeah, yeah he's a barber. Thank you. Awesome. <laughs> All righty. So we do still like still have every day. four balloons left unpopped. I'm going to go ahead and have you ask these guys a question just to help you narrow it down, see who's more your type. Okay. How old are you guys and what do you do for work and do you enjoy what you do for work? Mm. Okay. Name, age, and do you enjoy what you do for work? I'm Antoine. I'm 35. I'm a school safety specialist. Um, I do real estate on the side, restaurant investor, and private What the hell is a school safety specialist? Action. I love what I do. Um, I do it because I didn't have anybody like me growing up, and because uh, I don't have a father, never had a father, so I want to be that for the kids. That's so awesome. yeah, I like that answer. <laughs> okay, let's go to our next guy. Name and age, and the answer to your question. I'm Raylan. Ramon, and I'm 36. Oh, Ramon. I own an auto detailing business. I do Airbnb, and I own a fleet rental company. Cool. And then I think you said, do you enjoy what you do? Oh yes, and do you? Oh enjoy yeah, it? I love it. You know, financial freedom. Period. <laughs> he rich. Name and age and the answer to your question. Uh, JD, 35. Uh, I'm, a, I'm a building engineer. So, um, yeah, I love what I do. You know, I come a long he way. He make so a lot of money, too. It took me, like, a lot of years, you know, to know, like, what I really wanted to do in life. So, you know, before that, I was, like, I did security for, like, a long time. So I went to school. You know, I figured it out. So we're here now, though, you know, getting to the bag. Right. For sure, Ski. <laughs> and our next guy over here. Name, age, and the answer to your question. Brian K. Johnson, 37, out of Atlanta, Georgia. Um, Security I work for the water monitor? department in the county, but I, I also do like music Security. and movies. So I respect the, the hustle of the cocktail waitress. I hate this I dude. like that because it's like I still got a regular gig, but I'm still doing my content creation. So I respect that. Thank you. For sure. Okay. And do you enjoy what you do? I enjoy the music and the movies. The water department pays the bills. All right, now. That's <laughs> so fair. I, I, mean, I, I respect both, but I like the music and the movies better. Okay. okay, awesome. All right. Pop his so, get based us, get off it of what you've heard, what you see, all that good stuff, I am going to have you pop. Hmm, let's go with two balloons. So, two. let me give you a pick. Let's get these two out the way. There you go. And go ahead and pop those two. <laughs> okay. Uh huh. Okay. We knew. 
Okay, you can stay there. We'll start with him. Perfect. All right, so Brian, why did you have your balloon unpopped? Very stunning. Very, I like the upbeat. I like the, the, the kind of sedity. You know, I'm from the east side, so I respect that from Atlanta. I like the sedity, kind of well put together, know how to talk, upbeat. I love that. Thank you. Oh, that's so somebody you come home to. I respect that. Got it. Okay, sure. so why do we end up popping his? Um, I think you're handsome. It's like somebody maybe a little bit taller and a little bit more clean cut. Okay. okay. But I think you're awesome. Clean cut, you mean a shave? Or? I mean, um, clean I don't know got, if it's, got to be. Or, do you have dreads? Locks. I Locks, yeah. That's not I my, get them styled every year. I think that's cool. I just usually date guys with more shorter sure, yeah. hair. Okay. That's just my oh. typical look. Nothing bad. Okay, I respect it. I got you. <laughs> All right. Sure. I mean, yeah, Thank he you. got brains. Okay, why did you have your balloon unpopped for her? Uh, I thought she was gorgeous, you know what I mean? Dress look fire, you feel me? Love the tattoos too, you know, I'm in tattoos and stuff and all that. Thank you. So yeah. Okay. So why did we end up popping his? Um, I think you're handsome. I think that you're a little bit more light skinned than some of the guys that I date. It's not a bad thing. I mean, if I had to like look at the line, it's not funny. But if I had to look at the lineup, I think that is just. Yeah. Yeah. I, I feel it though. I think honestly, it's like, you know, like with the Kendrick and the Drake battle right now, like I think we're taking an L right now. You feel me? Light skinned niggas. Okay. <laughs> you know. Y'all definitely taking an L right we're now. down right now. I mean, but you're awesome. I appreciate she it. She definitely it's, it's looked special. back like, I shouldn't have said that. I shouldn't have. I was only talking about him, Big Daddy. I was only talking about him, Big Daddy. You done fucked up, friend. Thank you. We did get a pop back here. What's going on? Why are we popping? She look amazing. Um, it's more so, you like clean cut. You know, I got cornrows. You ain't like his uh, dreads. Okay. So I just popped it off that aspect. Okay. I'm not sure if, you know what I mean? Hmm. Okay. I think braids and dreads are a little bit different. different. I don't know. Like locks, I just aren't my necessarily I'm thing. I don't know what it is about it. Yeah. But you got a nice little lineup. I hate you look your great. shirt. Appreciate I'm pop it. That's I'm okay. sorry. Don't I'm be sorry, sorry baby. Uh, it's okay. <laughs> 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 All right. So, I mean, you compliment his hair. So, is he someone that is your type? Yeah, you're super handsome. I like your jewelry. I like your outfit. Sure. Yeah, you look great. You look great, too. Thank you. All right. So we do have one balloon left on you know, I love the fact that she ain't pressed. She ain't pressed about no nigga. Any questions for our girl here? What's your credit score like? Ooh. Ooh, that's a good question. Right now, my credit score is a 740. Like 743 or something like that. Okay. That's how she get to shop, shrimp dick. Your job ain't had nothing with the money that you be shopping with. Hell wrong with him. I don't see how you able to go get no food from the mall and you work at the mall. Head ass. Girl with a 740 credit score, she can get a $20,000 limit. Yeah. How much? Take the card. Did you say black card? Here I am. How much? Here you go. Take it. Long as it's paid for by the end of the month. Fuck him. Okay. That's the only question I That's got. That's the only question? Yeah. Okay, any questions for him? Yes. Um, What's you your credit score, Nick? I have two daughters. Okay, how old are they? 12 and 13. Do you feel like you have a healthy co-parenting scenario? For sure. I think that's really important. He looks Especially like he when I'm being older now. You know, at first scenario. it was a little, you know, we was both young, you know? So as we got older and matured, everything got a lot better. That makes sense. I think too young scares me, you know? Yeah. <laughs> for sure. Absolutely. Okay. All right, well, let's come on up here. Come on up, come on up, come on up. All right, so I know you had no more questions. Are you good? Any questions, I Aaron? do have another question. Oh. Do you live in Arizona? Yes, I do. I've okay. been here uh, back and forth for four years, here officially for two years. Okay, cool. All right. Okay, so my final question, is it a yes for you for her? For sure. Is it a yes for you for him? Yes, we got a yes. man! Yes. Kitty, no All right, I'll take this mic and you guys no can go on off. Yes! <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. Oh. Woohoo! Yeah! Hello, welcome in. What's your name? Uh, Kiana. Kiana, how old are you? I'm 28. Sorry okay. to think about it. <laughs> oh, she's and what do you pretty. do? Um, I have my she doctorate in physical no therapy, hips. so I'm an inpatient physical therapist. Um, and then I own she my own no hips. She about right. Fitness business, so very yeah. cool. Uh, what are some things you like to do for fun? She don't really um, have no ass either, but she's gorgeous. I like to dance. I grew up doing like studio dance, so like liturgical oh, hey. dance, hip hop. 
contemporary, all types of dance. Okay. So now I just do it for fun. Um, so I like to do like heels classes when they come up or like hip hop classes. Mm. Um, I do work out a lot. So I do like to go to the gym as like a stress reliever Y'all, or just like, no you know, a fun thing. So I'm bored. I'll go to the shit. gym <laughs> <laughs> and, um, or I'll go for a run. Okay. And she looked like she go for and a run. sleep. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's another hobby of mine. <laughs> All right. Now, uh, what are some things you look for in a man? Um, a few things I look for that are important are for them to be trustworthy. Mm-hmm. Um, good hygiene is another one I look for in a man. Also, someone who's looking for a relationship. I mm. think that one's it's not a given. It's not a given. <laughs> um, and looking to build. Okay. Another thing would be. Don't say God fearing, please. Someone who is calm. Mm. Okay. So like I need a calm partner. I very much like. <laughs> I very much like um, just Mr. like. Mr. New York, you ain't calm. Soft, low tone. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> You're good. Um, atmosphere. Like I'm very, I'm much of an extrovert outside. And like I teach classes. I bring out a very extrovert. Them niggas give me like, bitch, I'll beat your ass. I know you from New York, but damn, no, no calm at all. Like, all she's saying is, babe, you want a glass of wine tonight <laughs> before we go to sleep? <laughs> like, that's what she gives me. Like, damn. Type of energy. No, when I'm bitch, at home, I, like I want some Hennessy. Fuck you giving me wine for. Hey, that. Like, that's what both of them give me. Okay. Ugh. Opposite. I like to be able to like be somber and very like cuddly just... and super like calm and, and peaceful with my like person. Okay, okay, so, so what are wine. some of your deal breakers? <laughs> um, poor hygiene is a deal breaker for me. Okay. We gotta shower like all the time. If you change <laughs> clothes, you gotta shower. You gotta okay. shower again. If we do anything special, you gotta shower. Okay. Um, she like them clean. And another deal breaker would be someone who's confrontational, who just likes to like- I don't know if she like, pay people. It's given she do. Mm. I'm not really an arguer. Okay. Yeah. Well, I, don't I really... attempted to do this, especially when I was able to like, cause it costs to do this shit. Like, um, sometimes it'd be like fifty dollars a head. So remember, she has the woman and the people, but you know, like the twenty v ones. You got to pay for the celebrity to come. Then you got to pay the models that's there. This is a lot of paying factors here. To debate about things. <laughs> it wasn't all right. So we did I got get kids and shit. I'm a chill right now. A couple of pop balloons. <laughs> let's go on over there, see why they ended up popping. All right, let's start with your name and age. My name is Kashim, and I'm 38 years old. Okay. She told me. Why did you end up popping your balloon? Well, first, I'm going to say that you are very attractive um, from head to toe. Like, you're well put together. Thank you. However, <laughs> because of my energy, it can come off a certain kind of way. So I don't want my energy to offend you any kind of way. You're like, oh, you're too much. Look, we're good. All right. You find you a calm guy. You know what I mean? Like, I am who I am. So okay, yep. <laughs> I can't be calm at times, but like normally I'm just like, you know what I mean? So Okay. Okay. He's now, is he someone that's your type? Um <laughs> I don't think so, no. Okay. What well, makes him not really your type? Mostly height, kind of dress as well. But I'm I kind of so like the dress. Of hearing that. Okay. Just, just, I just, I don't know. I feel like if this was a date, I would have probably wanted a little more. That's fair. Depending I wouldn't wear this on a date, date though. Okay. Yeah, okay. Nah, I'll be nice, okay. put together. Is this like an everyday look? Uh, it's kind of a little bit of whatever. And I had to represent. You know, I'm from New York, so I had to represent. I can tell. You can tell. Okay. Let's go on our next pop balloon here. Name, age, and why you ended up popping your balloon. My name is Anthony. I'm 36 or 37. I'm not sure. I keep, but here nor there. Yo, what? That's weird. That's weird. He's definitely midnight dick. Three in the morning. Hold on. My baby getting up because she thinks she got to go to school right quick. Go back to sleep. Finish. Leave. Y'all, he's stressing me out. <laughs> uh, my birthday, I think I'm 36 or 37, not really sure yet. <sighs> Look at her face. She don't know what's going on. 
there's nothing wrong with you. It's something wrong with me. I like to argue, so. Oh, <laughs> I mean, I don't think that's a problem. Some Somebody might like that. Yeah, you know? so Somebody might like it. I need a little fight back, you know what I mean? Like, oh, I don't want you to just be. Okay. Hey. Because I, I will take over. Like, but I, I, mean, I need a little kickback. You know what I mean? Like, I definitely do give kickback, but that's not what I prefer. I hear you. I'm just, that's just I'm a very what I'm saying. Like, I'm used to. <laughs> but. I'm used to what I really I'm used to. I like to sit in my femininity. Okay. I just really like to be a woman and a girl. Okay. And I don't want to have to, like, be that. Yeah. 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 I hear it's, you. That's a great thing. But I'm I can do it. I'm just used to what I'm used to. So maybe that's my problem. I respect it. Yes, Thank you. You should be on the show. See someone that's your type. He came here so he didn't get fine. Her arms is bigger than his, y'all. Eyes, bitch. <sighs> Look, she like these and he like this. She can no. pick that Kinda. thing up. I like the tattoos. This is the prime yeah. example of me telling my cousin the other day that some women will be able to bench press your ass, nigga. She is an example. He the type to start going at it with her. She get to fighting him. Be like, damn, you strong. <laughs> damn. You a little strong, ain't you? <laughs> I work out. <laughs> damn. So what's the other part? The fit is is me. Okay. The outfit is not me, for me. Um, yeah, okay. that would be that. All right, I'm gonna pop another balloon for myself. <laughs> All right, let's go. Get away from his weird ass. <laughs> okay, so we do still have four balloons left unpopped. Pop. Let me go his. ahead and have you ask these guys a question and help you narrow it down. Um. It, okay. I've got a question. What is your occupation and then what is a typical day for you look like? Like a typical weekday, what are you doing? Okay. Name, age, and what's your occupation and what does your typical day look like? My name's Antoine, I'm 35. My occupation is I'm a school safety specialist. I have a lot of other things as well, but just to narrow it down, that's what I do. Um, typical day for me is going to work uh, with the kids. I work in the school um, where I carry. I used to be, I'm a former police officer as well. Okay. Um, after work, I go straight to the gym. Like straight to the gym, then after the gym, I'm actually prepping food to cook because I don't meal prep. You probably meal prep, don't you? Sometimes. I like my <laughs> Which food. <sounds> better. <laughs> I like my food hot, so I cook. I like it every day I cook. Okay. Um, then after that, I put a movie on until the movie and start watching. I don't watching. feel bad at all. I don't like, like meal prep cute till you gotta warm that shit up. Like I've been seeing like warmed up, um, like, if y'all try Greek yogurt cheese, I know it sounds crazy, but just hear me out. Greek yogurt cheese, a little bit of hot sauce, and, like, some chicken. I think that's it. So good. I'm a, I can't even eat grilled chicken. I'm going to try it with shrimp. So good, right? But I can't imagine myself warming that up for five days a week. So, no. Watching me for real. Okay. Okay. Greek yogurt thing. is better than sour cream. Uh, Chrissy. It's okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Let's go to our next guy. Your name, age, occupation, and attribution. Yeah, JD. Uh, I'm a building engineer. Can't knock it to you. Like, try. as far as like day to day, like like at work or just my full day. Just like a regular day, like during the week. So yeah, like, if you're at work, so like, like at work? some people aren't at work, so that's why I'm asking. Okay. No, I want to eat. Uh, yeah, I just why? be fixing things like around the buildings and stuff. I manage like three different buildings, so I be painting, uh, fixing doors. A little bit of everything, you know, whatever you need fixed, you feel me, I, I could do. So if you need some fixes at the house, tap me in, you feel me? I'm a good handyman. Gotcha. Gotcha. <laughs> okay. And then once you're off work, what is your day like? I think that was more sort of question. Yeah. Uh, I'm getting old now, so I just, I just want to go to sleep. <laughs> feel me when I get home after, you know, I work hard, so you feel me? Okay. Yeah. What's your age again? 35. 35, okay. Yeah. It's going over here. He said, I'm a little old. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Your name and age and the answer to her question. Girl, punch him uh, in the face. My name is Braylon. I'm 37, Cleveland, Ohio. Um, I work in mental health. I counsel people with substance abuse and mental health issues. Um, a typical day is I probably wake up at like 8 and go talk to one of my clients or making sure that everything is all right with them. Um, I do go to the gym midday. Shout out Extreme Compound, Cleveland, Ohio. Feel. 
Um, we do step classes there, so I try to stay in shape that way, lift. Um, and then I go see another client. And then I might go to another step class because he do two of them in a day. Okay. So, and after that, I kind of... Cap, y'all got the same arms. Go home. Uh, I do like the meal prep sometimes. Or I hit up Grill 55, Cleveland, Ohio. <laughs> Let me tell y'all something. When he like a woman, he be putting on this front to she show him who she really is. Then he show her who he really is. Who he really is is who he's been to all these other women. Don't choose this nigga. He's a bitch. Don't choose this man. I do not like this man. <laughs> he's so rude. But you can tell he a gaslight a woman to get what he want. He the type that'll like gaslight you into your coochie. Get it. Then be like the shit wasn't all that good anyway. Like that is him. Oh. And for him to say mental health specialist and all this other weird old book, I do not like this nigga right here, boy. <laughs> Food is mad good. <laughs> Crazy. So, uh, yeah, and then I just go home, chill, watch my shows, uh, my Netflix shows and everything like that. And he ain't getting no easy. ass. He's so damn rude. <laughs> all right, name, age, occupation, and what does a typical day look like for you? Brian K. Johnson, 37, Atlanta, Georgia, uh, Eastside. I'm actually uh, working for the county. I work for the water department. So if I'm not doing that. I wake up, I work out, do my push-ups. I pray to God, take the shower, hit the work, go to work. Um, I work those eight hours and Monday through Thursday, I do another shift that's 10 hours. But Friday, Saturday, Sunday, I'm free. So Friday, working out, Saturday, working out, Sunday, go to church and just repeat. You know what I'm saying? Talk to the family, repeat, always check in. So I write a lot of music and uh, I'm actually working on some movies as well. So Friday, sucker. Saturday, Sunday, kind of plug it in. Right, He's a sucker. Right. Yeah, I'm working, <laughs> man. I'm a good. working man. No, All he right. don't work out. Let's head on back. Okay, so it is time to pop. <sighs> so let me hand you a pig. Wait. <laughs> there you go. And I am going to okay. have you pop two balloons. Don't you dare two. pop that two. chocolate, man. Yes. <laughs> So go ahead and pop those Please two. Please get Mr. Bands out of here. And then once you're done popping, I'll ask why you ended up popping. Oh, two balloons. <laughs> <laughs> Typical day, not the whole week. Okay. Please. Oh, that's so hard. All no, white. Get him. He ain't shit, friend. That's so hard. Trust me. And Leo got little dick. <sighs> Both of them do. Can I ask one more question before that? No, after this round. Nope. No, yeah, okay. yeah, you got to no, pop those two. No, two. <laughs> Dig. Okay. All right, pop one. One's, one's already popped. <laughs> um, this one. Oh, yeah. A little more force. Oh. Okay, so why did we end up popping his? Um, I really did like your answers. I really do like... Now, Mr. Chocolate, what? what's wrong with you? He probably like, girl, you knew you, knew you wanted me, and you bullshitted. Like that you are a God-fearing man. We love that. That was so... <laughs> Sure. Plus, plus, all together. Um, I feel like, I don't know. It's really just, you're just like not my type. I got you. What's your type? Probably a little taller. taller. Okay. Just a tad bit taller. Gotcha. Definitely the outfit gives me like How older man. Come on now. 37. Tell the truth. 37. Not, right, not 51. Right. Get which the is shoes. A, which is a little much. Just okay, little much. thirty-seven. Can't okay, help that, but I got you. Which is okay. But literally, your answers were so great. If you were just like looking younger, sixty-five, not even a little younger. If you just like, you know, some people are older, but they're they could act younger. Not act younger, but like they present a little bit like more playful. Uh, like there's some men that are like grown men. There's yeah, other men that yeah. like have like oh, a, there's sure. like a two oh, yeah gotcha. two sides to it. <laughs> yeah, I feel like I'm already twenty-eight, and then you're thirty-seven. Plus you're on that older thirty-seven. Uh, Damn. Not, yeah. For sure. Yeah. For sure. yeah. Gotcha. Thank you. <laughs> All right, and we did get a pop back here. Why did we end up popping? Cause somebody that's for me wouldn't take that long. Wow. Damn. But uh, one thing I do like. Okay. Your natural beauty. I love that. Thank you. Um, you go to the gym. That's a plus. Just Somebody for me wouldn't take that long. I'm going to tell y'all right now, he looking for an Instagram DM. I would have told him to unpop. <laughs> I would have told him to unpop. Hey, hey, hey. Let me tell you something, gang. Cause somebody for me wouldn't take that long. I, nigga, bitch. 
That was a line. That was a line right there. Mm -hmm. Just that. Man, it took too long. I do take long with my responses in general in life. Um, I'm like a very, what's the word? The word I'm looking for. Patient. Articulate person. So I like, got, sure. like to think about my answers before I say something um, and really make a decision. So, sure. yeah, that's why I like take my time because I really like to factor anyway. in everything. I need you to see speaking. me. I need you to see me and want me. You're you know right. Saying? You're right. You know You're saying? right. It's just that it was a line up and that was the only reason why because you look great. Thank you. You fit. I love the natural beauty. All of my queens who, the natural <laughs> look. I love that. And uh, you have a nice smile. All right, so we do have two guys left. Guys, any questions for her? Got any yeah. brewing? All right, let's go over here. Uh, do we have any kids? No, I don't have any kids. No kids? Okay. How old are you again? 28. 28, okay. Uh, what's your son? Do he just give y'all, he want to just do it too? Like, just do it and that's it? <laughs> like, it's something about this nigga. He just give me like, what you doing tonight? Oh, nothing the regular. Let me come put the head in. Like, y'all don't get that from him? He want to wife somebody, but she but she take care of him. I think he get his own money. <clears throat> I don't get him want no money. I just get him being real like, he want to do it. And that's it. Oh, not money. Just oh, take care of him like house, like a wife type type shit. Okay, yes, he does give that. He does give that. Scorpio. Okay. November Scorpio. I think we good. Good. All right. Any questions over here? He just Troll. asked my question. All of them. Two of them. Yeah. Do you guys have any kids? No kids. You have kids. I have one son. One son. What's the age? Uh, he's twelve, about to be thirteen. He's a Scorpio. Okay. What's your um, relationship with the mother? Well, I, you know, it's okay. Um, I take hold of my son, so I definitely take care of my son, um, do what I got to do for him. And, you know, my son has his own everything. So, you know, I try not to get in her business and she don't get in mine. So I think that's awesome. Okay. okay. Any other questions? No? He lying. He got another one. Oh. Is that your real hair? Yes. <laughs> Remember, though, that was a good question. I'm not going to lie, even though I don't like his ass. He don't like weave. He like natural women. I do, too. Hence, my honey's house. I ain't going to lie. I can't do too much of that. Don't get me wrong. It looks nice. So I would say, oh, my God, that's such a nice wig. Until it's all over my house, like my daughter right now. She just got hair. Everywhere we look, we see London. It's not a wig or nothing. She just got some weave, okay? And none of us is used to it. We all in here dread-headed up and shit. Like, even Mango, like, what? what? What is this? London. Everywhere, okay? I can't deal with that, all right? Can't stand makeup, all right? Not that I hate makeup. I don't like a lot of it, and I, you don't need it every day. Do not hug me and leave makeup on my fucking shoulder. I'm pissed. Okay? So, I don't... Mm -mm. I love... When I met Honey Sauce, because I love Honey Sauce, but when I met her, I love the fact that she wasn't all of that. Okay? That's the beautiful thing to me. Now, once again, that ain't no offense to if you... Not natural, if you got the weed, if you got the eye like I don't give a damn, friend. You know I rock with you regardless. Okay, I'm just saying my preference in my house, okay? That's all, that's all. So he just don't like a, a, a bunch of shit, but that don't mean you got to be rude to a woman. You know what I'm saying? Yep, that's, that's, oh, okay. that's all me. That's all me. Why it's and getting bigger as we speak because we're sweating. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so I am going to have you pop a balloon. Pop his, the white, please. Sorry. Oh, okay. no! Why do we end up popping his? Um... He had very good answers. I just feel like he's more my type. And yeah, honestly, you both are my type. Is, is Yeah. 
Okay. Appreciate it, love. All right, let's bring you on up. Come on up here. Come oh, on up. My God. <laughs> okay. I mean, he Looks got like you were stuck and you have any more questions. I got something to say. Uh oh, go ahead. Um, it's the baby giving off the Serena look, bro. <laughs> the Serena. athleticism, bro, that is beautiful. <laughs> Thank love. you. This mother bitch. Mango. Why Mango done came here? Mega, I don't need nothing. I'm fighting the air. I don't even need shit. This motherfucker. Baby, you giving off the Serena look, baby. You stay seeing fun, baby. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I love this shit. Go ahead. Um, Any more questions? I got something to say. Uh -oh, You're a gaslighter. Um, it's the baby giving off the Serena look, bro. <laughs> the Serena. athleticism, bro, that is beautiful. <laughs> Thank I you. It. I love the shoulders. Okay. I love it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Any other questions? She is beautiful. She is. He ain't lying. But nigga, soon as she piss him off, guarantee. And y'all, they got the um, which I didn't know. Somebody sent me. <clears throat> But she got the checkup dates on these people. So I cannot wait to see the checkup on this. Y'all keep me tuned in on the checkup. Okay, because I want to see how this went. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, I do have a good, I have a question. Okay. Um, what would be your top three, like, love languages? Obviously, there's more, but the ideal ones, what are your top three? Um, physical touch, quality time. And I mean, acts of kindness, I would think, but you know, I, I, I'm really kind. It's acts of service, you bitch. He lying. He's lying. Acts of kindness. No, he ain't kind. He's a little demon. I can't even airbox because mango all in my business. I... <sighs> I'm uh, my own person, so I don't really need you to do too much. Okay. Just be there for me. You know, just be able to talk to me. Okay. All right, so my he final question talk. now, is it going to be a yes for you for her? Um, yes, she's okay. beautiful. Okay, and is it a yes for you for him? It is a yes. We got a match! <laughs> <laughs> I'll take this mic, and you guys can go on off. All right now, hey. <laughs> I'm not happy. All right, let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. Girl, she gonna find out, woo! She gonna see it and be like, damn, he was rude to these other women. Hello, welcome in. What's your name? My name is Ari. Ari, how old are you? I am 26 years old. Okay, and what do you do? I am the owner of Alita Aesthetics. Okay. <laughs> and now She's what a woman of God. Fun? Um, I like to paint I hate and dance dress. and... I don't know. I like to stay home, watch movies, and dress. just enjoy, you know, nice, cozy vibes, mm, for I sure. All right. Now, what are some things you look for in a man? Um, man I God. would love somebody that is, um, I would say, just as passionate as okay. building a family as I am. Okay. Um, somebody that is genuine in all aspects of themselves. Okay. As far as, you know, being just a good person in front of someone in front of someone as well as behind their back okay and somebody that loves animals <laughs> absolutely okay yeah. now what are some of your deal breakers my deal breakers is, 11, 11 um, and Houston. i would say somebody that not necessarily a smoker but if that is your <sighs> daily habits something you are dependent on that is my deal breaker okay Got yeah. It. All right. 
So we do have no pop balloons. Yes, girl. Oh, smoke so friend. don't let them get What that like means you. is uh first round, I am gonna have you pop. Hmm, how many balloons should we do? Don't let Let's them do two balloons. Like first... Okay. I'm gonna have you pop two balloons, kind of okay. based off of you know what you're seeing so far. It doesn't really fall into your type, so let okay. me give you a pick. Okay. There you go. Thank you. And just go ahead and pop those two. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, Please. Why are you hiding your balloon? You gotta work for it. Oh. Okay. I'm sorry. All right, and then one more. What do you want to do? Can I? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's start right here. Okay. Your name and age. Brian K. Johnson, 37, from Lithonia, Atlanta. Man, what come on, bro. And Brian, why did you have your balloon unpopped? I mean, I like the gypsy shoes. That got me. I like the gypsy, you know, the little vibe. She got Thank the you. ring with the name. From I like that. Thank you. Kind of got that youthful vibe. I like Absolutely. that. Probably can learn from you. We learn from each other. And then you got the, the baby hair. I like the baby oh. hair. Thank you. So it was straight. Yeah, he I like is what exhausting. you came out with. It was cool. Thank Threw you. it on. Thank something you. different. I like that. Thank you. <laughs> now, why did we end up popping his balloon? Um, I think. I'm sorry. I was going to say she gives me, like, wake up in the morning, smoke a blunt. Now we've been reacting to this for an hour and 25 minutes. That's why we don't be reacting to the whole things. But I'm not going to lie. This was a good lineup. But she gives me like wake up in the morning, do her uh, meditations, smoke a blunt. I was all wrong. I guess she don't do that. Based it off of just physical attraction compared to everybody that's up here. More push just that. Yeah. Do some more push-ups. Just a little bit. Look, He's insecure push about himself. <laughs> Let me get this in. He's insecure about himself. Okay. Let me do my push-ups. <laughs> All right. Thank okay. you. Let's go over here. Your name and age. Kashim. I'm 38. Okay. <clears throat> Why did you have your balloon unpopped for her? I just wanted to give her a chance. I mean, well put together. I like the dress. I mean, you look like you bathe in sage. No, she has burned. And <laughs> all yes. kinds of like spiritual. See? Like I felt that spirit. And it was See? like, wow. okay, I like that. Thank um, you. So it was the spirit that kept me. But I wanted to give you more of a chance to get to know like more about you. Mm. Physically, I like them a little thicker. You know what I'm okay. saying? With some meat on their bones. But yeah, I just like the presence though. And I was like, all right, let me get to know a little bit more about you. Okay, okay. Yeah. All right. That's so why do we end up popping his? Once again, I think physical attraction. I'm going based off of what we have left. And then also I am, you know, I, the heels give some height. I think height is a slight thing for me. Ah, uh, boo. <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> Eh, whatever. It's cool. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right. So we do have our three remaining guys. I'm going to have you ask them a question. What he want to say so bad is he got a big me. Guarantee. Yeah, I know the size. I know I'm short, but I ain't short now. He want to say it, but he don't want to be a creep. Jen, just help you narrow it down. Okay. Um, simple question. Um, What does the next five years look like for you guys? Okay. Let's start with your name and age and the answer to our question. The next, oh, Antoine, I'm 35. The next five years for me, I feel like I have everything put together. The only okay. thing I'm missing is a family. Um, mm -hmm. So the next five years would be that. Everything else is... Uh, they would have a gorgeous baby. It's a shame we do that to each other, but it is what it is. Exactly, I would say. Okay. Yeah. Let's go on over here. Name and age and ask your question. Uh, 35. Uh, JD. Uh, in five years? Five years. Uh... Trying to hit the lottery, man. Like bow wow and um, <laughs> and lottery ticket. You feel me? Trying to hit the lotto. Are we all? But uh, now nah, I'm just trying to build. You know, career wise, I'm a building engineer, so okay. I'm trying to like maybe get my own business or something. While I take okay. you to pound town. Stuff like that. Okay. Yeah. Literal. Last guy down here. Name, age, and answer to her question. Anthony, 36 or 37. <laughs> uh. She's so. I'm just blessed to be I alive. In the next five years, I don't really. I'm blessed to be alive, like where I'm from. Okay. Like, I, I'm blessed to be alive. Yeah, just so. the fact that you made it to right now is a blessing. Alone. Yeah. So in the next five years, I hope I have a shop, my own barber okay. shop or something like that. But okay. I'm just blessed to be alive. I can't I'm fuck with a nigga that say he a hope he have one. I can't do it. I hope I'ma have a barber shop. Next five. That's years. beautiful. Okay. At least All right. I plan on. So I'm going have... with that. Being said, go ahead and pop one balloon. Oh. Girl, bring your ass <laughs> down here. Go on, um, bro, come down here. I'm sorry. 
Okay, where do you end up popping his? Um, I don't normally date light skins. I think once again, physical attraction. Um, I honestly, if I'm being honest, I know which answer resonated with me better. So you said one balloon, and I just pop one balloon. Respect that, respect it. Yeah. Yeah, all right. it's all love. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Any other questions, guys, or for you to them? Guys, any questions for her? Absolutely. Okay, let's start here. What makes you happy? Oh, I, it might not look like it, but I love food. <laughs> I am a foodie. I love food of all ranges, all, all cultures. I love music a lot. Um, she looks like she a vibe. The, the, the smoke and blunt part, I'm, I'm kind of... <laughs> She just look like she smoke a blunt. But, you know, it's fine if she don't. Afrobeats, compa, all that. Um, yeah, but I, if I had to... Maybe she's a drink. Um, bring it down to one thing, music for sure. That makes me really happy. Okay. Or maybe she, she's a sageologist. So who makes you happy? Who, who makes you happy? What makes you wake up every day and want to do what you do? My cat. You who? <laughs> my cat. I honestly, like, as of right now, I love my family, of course, I do. But my cat, he's like, you know, the closest thing I have to, like, a little child. And that is why I wake up every day. You know, she says you got to love animals, nigga. He did not like that answer. To feed him, go home. I look forward to seeing him. <sighs> yeah, that is who makes me happy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> why do you end up hopping? I'm going to keep it all the way tall. Yes. I, I know you're an animal lover. I love animals, too. Oh. But I hate cats. <sighs> I ain't gonna lie to you. That'd be I would have popped. That'd be a problem. You feel that me? That would have been horrific. Um, they sneaky. No, they're not. They. You know what I mean, <laughs> I'm not. I just. Look at how ready I just don't beef. like cats personally. But That's you look, fine. You look great. Thank you. You look I great. It. Skin great. Thank Everything's you. Everything's great. Thank you. Thank just you. Just that animals like the cat. Are you kidding? Uh, yeah. That's crazy. <laughs> okay. Okay. So, now is he someone? A couple of them slid in his DM when this shit was over. That's your type? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Tall, dark skin, the outfit is amazing. Appreciate Great you. voice, nice teeth, yeah. Appreciate you. Absolutely. Okay. All right, so we do have one balloon left. Let's head down over here. Uh, all right, oh any questions for God. her? Where do you see yourself in the next five years? He smoked weed! For five years. Um, I am 26, so I know it is young, but I would like to at least at that point, be a little bit more settled down. Um, hopefully have my first home, couple cars, maybe one kid, and just maybe one kid, either traveling a little bit or one boy kid. Boy or girl? Of... It doesn't matter, nigga. Um, I'd prefer a boy first, uh, for sure. But it doesn't matter to me either or. Uh, and that's what I'm looking forward to, just starting my family, at least the start of it. Cool beings. Yeah. Okay. Questions? Um, what did you say you do for work again? I'm a barber. You're a barber. Okay. And you said you're 37? 30? I'm 36. You're 36. But I'll be 37 at the end of the year. Okay, 36, 37. Um, oof. You good? Are you feeling it? or? I might have to pop. Okay. Yes, go I'm ahead, sorry. go ahead. Yeah. While we pop it. Um, I think. He too old for you. I think it's just the overall vibe. You are very sweet. I love the voice. I think aesthetically, maybe not. Um, I think also with your age. I don't know. It depends. I don't know what the finances are giving, but at your age as well as, um, I don't know. I don't want to get canceled. Lord have mercy. No. <laughs> she, wanna, she, she was going to say she think he should have a house and shit already or his own barbershop and shit. Speak your mind, girl. No, I just, I think I might be just looking for a little bit more. Just a little bit. I don't know. But I, I can't know. judge. Yeah, I'm going based off of just what I heard. Yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. No smoke. All right. <laughs> Let's head on back. All right. Well, that's all the balloons popped, okay. but we do thank you so much for coming on. Thank you. Let's go ahead and give it up for her, guys. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> okay. Let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. Woohoo! Hello. Welcome in. What's your name? Daniela. Daniela, how old are you? I'm 31. Okay, and what do you do? I hate it. I'm an esthetician. I focus on facials and cryo slimming and shaping. Hey, what are some things you like to do for fun? Uh, I love cooking, I like reading, traveling. 
Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, what are some things you look for in a man? Someone who's kind, well-rounded, um, ambitious and passionate about the life he's curating, hmm. goal-oriented. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay. Now, what are some of your deal breakers? She boring, y'all. She boring. I can't do it. She should. She should end up with Atlanta. She ended up with Atlanta. <laughs> I'm still thinking, but yeah, we can, yeah, most definitely. I could talk about it at dinner time. Yeah, I'll take it to dinner. Okay. <gasps> Is it a... <laughs> All right, guys. So I have a final question if there are no others. Okay. So is it going to be a yes for you for her? I'm still thinking, but yeah, we can, yeah, most definitely. I could talk about it at dinner time. Yeah, I'll take it to dinner. Yeah, okay. Sure. Is it a yes for you for him? Sure. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess we got a match. <laughs> uh, All right, I'll take this, and you guys can go on off. <laughs> what? You gotta grab her head. What are you supposed to do? You gotta grab oh, her head. Oh, 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 my bitch. Oh, yeah, just make sure that You're the home. most awkward Leo I have ever seen in my life. He's born in July. I don't know what you better grab her hand and make up for it. Thank you everyone for tuning into this episode of Pop the Balloon or Find Love. If you that was so terrible. <clears throat> y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I'm done with this video. Love y'all, appreciate y'all. Hey,